All right, so let's All get right, started. So let's get started. And here is the story about the story Gibeon. About Gibeon. Enjoy. Enjoy. It was Christmas time, was the, Christmas season, time. For the season for giving. But for Howard B. Wigglebottom, it was Wigglebottom. the season for getting. for getting. Getting new things getting made new Howard things happy made for, a while. for a while. But soon he would but get bored and get want bored more stuff. Howard, you need to learn to share. Howard wasn't listening. Howard looks really angry at his mom. He says, Mom, I'm almost finished with this for Santa. Oh, Howard, sighed his words. You already have way more than you need. But Howard wasn't paying attention. He was listening to TV commercials for ideas to add to his list. I'm guessing some of you have gotten some Christmas, Christmas, Christmas ideas for commercials, too. Yeah. Yeah. Well, here, Howard, here, you, Howard will go, you will be going to, to visit your cousins tomorrow, your cousin's mom, said his mom. Said his mom. Pack lots of warm warm clothes, clothes. but Howard wasn't listening. listening. He packed his toys instead. instead. Uh oh. So here they're getting ready to get on a train. And Howard and his family arrived at the station just in time. As he was getting on the train, his big bag got caught in the door. Or toys spilled toys all, spilled over. all over. over. When he hopped when off he to get them, the, the doors closed, doors closed and, the train, and left. the train left. Um, oh, Howard was all Howard alone, was alone now. now. I'm scared for Howard. Unsure where to go, he started, started walking. It was really cold. Really cold. Sort of like the last sort couple of days we had here in Goshen. Howard had no Howard money, had no, money no, food, no food, and no phone. And no phone. His toys were His really toys heavy, were really heavy. But there was no there way was he no was leaving them there. there. He heard noises, he heard around, noises him, around him, and Howard knew he Howard wasn't knew alone. Wasn't alone. Uh oh, I wonder who's with Howard. Who's with Howard? He started to run, started but the to run, but followed, him. followed him. Huh. huh. He found a place to hide. Place to hide. As, he As he stood there, cold, there and alone, cold and alone, he saw a family, saw having, a family dinner. having dinner. It made him really made him hungry. Really because when we're outside, we're outside we, we get hungrier, we get more, hungrier so than more so than inside. Than inside. Because the, the cold takes a lot of energy lot and makes us hungry. Howard began to cry began and to tears cry for and his cheeks. He thought, he thought I, I wish I could be warm and home, home with my family. family. But I ever but see I that ever again. See that sat down outside the window and soon fell sound asleep. Sound asleep. I'm really concerned that he's going to sleep outside. When Howard woke when up, Howard he heard up, a tiny heard voice saying, Are you the Santa Bunny? I have a letter for you. I have a letter for you. He jumped up and jumped grabbed up his things, grabbed yelling, things yelling, yelling, leave me alone. Leave me alone. He, was about to he was run, about to run, but, but tripped and rolled tripped and all, all the way down, down the hill. hill. Stuck and Stuck unable, and to, unable move, to move, he watched his toys watched being his toys grabbed. Being he tried to scream, but he couldn't because, because his mouth his was full of snow. snow. Howard became a giant snowman. And here's the one that's sided. So side 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 switch it so it's right side up. We just want to help Santa Bunny, said the birds as they put the toys back in the bag. We love you. Howard felt sad and ashamed. ashamed. They weren't after his toys. toys. Homeless like him, they were just trying to help. 
The bluebird gave Howard a piece of paper. Uh oh, what's on the piece of paper? It said, Dear Santa Bun, I will be so grateful if I can belong to a loving family. Thank you. Howard felt sad and ashamed. He had a very loving family he took for granted. He asked the others for their wishes. A warm bed, bed, and someone to say, I love you. They all answered. Right then, he decided to help and take them all home. He made a wish himself. Dear Santa, please forget my other list. Remember that list with all those toys? What I really want is to appreciate the good things I already have. Please help me. Hmm. I really like this picture. It's very colorful. And the birds are helping Howard to fly. Singing Christmas carols Christmas under the stars, under they stood together, together until they found the way to the Laird's house. Howard was happy Howard to, get, happy back to home. get back home. After feeding After his friends his and turning them into bed, into bed, he stayed up a little, stayed up longer, a little longer to look at his favorite, at his toys. favorite toys. He had too much had stuff. Too much stuff. Howard picked a special toy for each of his, his new friends. friends. He couldn't wait to couldn't see their faces see as they opened the presents. He had never he felt had never this joy before. before. The joy of giving the joy of from the heart. Giving from the heart. It makes us all feel so all feel warm and so to give it to somebody else. somebody else. If I could only have my only family have back again, Howard wished, Howard wished he could tell them he was so sorry, he was sorry for his old selfish, selfish ways. ways. Just then, the door Just opened, then, and there, there, they were. there they were. Howard, we've been Howard, looking, we've been all, looking over all over for you, over for you. Said, his mom. said his mom. How did you find your way home, you, you smart home. little boy? My new friends helped him, Howard said, said, and told his family told his everything that happened. Can they stay Can over they stay for the holidays? Of course, we would course, love to have them, Howard said. The next evening at Christmas dinner, Howard learned his parents were working on finding a home for all of his new friends. Look at that big celebration. Everybody sitting around the table. My, how did Howard suddenly? Everyone stopped and scared. Just kidding, he said. I'm into giving and sharing now. Happy holidays Happy and holidays Merry Christmas, Christmas, everyone. Christmas, everyone. All right. All right. So that is the so end of the story. And um, um, I'm curious, curious. what, uh, uh, how many of you learned, learned something, something from this story, story and what did you learn? What did you learn? And maybe have one or two maybe kids, kids share. Yes. Yep, we're just choosing where we write with you. Okay. Um, okay. Bernard. Um, the story was about, like, you shouldn't be selfish. And um, it's all about giving and friends and family. Yeah. And, yeah. and, what, and, and what, what made Howard what happy? Made Howard happy or, or giving? Or giving? Um, um. It was um, getting, I mean giving, because he got so happy when he got his um, family back, and he, and he gave presents to his friends, and he was so happy. That's right. That's right. And something else, something else uh, that was mentioned, that I think, was mentioned on, 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 that when we get when something, we get something we're, very, very we're very, very happy, very happy. But most of the time, most of the time we're only happy for a short happy, while. Short while. But when we give when we something, give others, something that others, happiness lasts. All right, how about somebody else? All right, how about somebody else? Caleb. Um, 
I think it kind of meant like when you give something to people, um, you'll get something back. Like um, when um, um, he made the presents for um the birds, um, he got his family back. Okay, and okay. And, 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 and also, and also, also friends, right? Friends, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, another question, uh, another question for some of you some is, 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 can you tell me some tell examples, me some examples, examples of when you've given a gift to somebody? Yeah. 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 When I was at home, um, and my mom and dad all get me gifts, but they says but they didn't get any. I decided to make a gift real quick, and then I gave it to them, and they were happy, and that made me happy. Very nice. Do you remember? Nice. 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 Um. If not, that's okay. If not, that's okay. 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 <laughs> How about some other about some examples other of gift giving? Gift giving. Brayden. Um, if you give, um, you, um, you can get new friends. Yeah. Yeah. It it yeah. It, it really helps. It really helps, helps in our relationship with friends. With friends. Yeah. How about another uh, idea another that's idea close that's to close the, the idea of giving gifts? Idea of giving gifts. And that's the idea oh, that's of the sharing. Idea of sharing. Have any of you ever any shared, of you something? shared something? Um. One. Um, so this Christmas, I haven't given the presents to my sisters yet, but I had made a lot of presents, and we were going to do a family Christmas, um, I think last Saturday, or was it, yeah, I think it was last Saturday, and, um, we were going to do one last Saturday, but, um, the, but on Friday, Mama, after, um, we homeschooled, Mama told us, um, that we wouldn't be able to, to, um, do, I mean, that we wouldn't do it because we would be able to celebrate celebrate Chris our fam our family Christmas on real Christmas Day. Um so I went up to my room and got um and brought down my basket of presents for my sisters and I let them each pick one to unwrap. Oh nice. They were oh, very nice. happy. That probably made them very happy. Them very yeah. happy. So how about sharing? So Has anybody, anybody shared something? Yeah. 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 Cyrus. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, one time, um, I, like, I was saving enough money, um, and I was thinking about only getting something for myself when I went for to the store with my mom, but then... Um, I secretly thought, um, why, um, why not get something for my mom too? And then, um, without my mom knowing, I got something for her. Good for you, and I hope yeah, we can. I hope we can. Always, 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 always. What can we do? What for can others? we do? For others? How about that? Uh, so uh, yeah, maybe so, I'll give an example. Um, uh, it's different than it's gift different giving, than but, it's, gift but it's, and that is and that is. I had to share, had to my, share mom my mom phone. So I use a lawnmower. So I use a lawnmower. My neighbor's lawnmower wasn't working. Wasn't working. So, I had, so I, had I, had I, had I had to share my lawnmower. And then when he was done, he gave it back. So what have you shared? Have you shared? Or, don't or give or them something as a gift, but you give them you give something for a period of time. Memory. Last night when I was um, making Christmas cookies, my dad let me um, pour in some sugar, and then I poured in some, but then I realized my little brother wasn't doing anything, so I let him pour in the rest. 
There you and go. Both, there you go. I both shared, like, he cracked one egg, I cracked the other. And he put in some vanilla, and I put in the rest of the vanilla. So you both get so to share the fun. The fun. You, didn't, you didn't keep all the you fun for yourself. You made your brother help, too. Brother help. All right, everyone. I, think, everyone. That's I think that's probably, all, probably I all I have today. I hope you are all continuing to stay healthy. healthy. Oh, I, I hope you can healthy. be healthy over be Christmas. Healthy over Christmas. And I hope you enjoy um, you enjoy the presents. presents. Um, I just want to say, um, when we are gonna make, I um, after school we're gonna frost cookies, but then um, sometimes when. When at uh, Christmas time, my grandma always makes these frosted cookies. So, um, but um, first she makes the um the dough, but then, but then she lets us um Alice and me um frost the cookies. And sometimes when my sister says please hand over the um the, like um a frosting color, um I usually hand it um to her and then she hand and then that. And if someone else wants it, um, then someone then she gives it to them, and it's kind of like sharing and yeah. also giving. Yeah. And like um, like what I give Mrs. Wangle today, um, I give her a present. Oh, very good. Oh, very good. That was something I was, was thinking about. I wonder if any of you are going to give Miss Wangle a gift. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, it's. It's clear to me that many of you know what it means to give a gift and to share. And I hope that makes you and others happy. And I hope it's something that you can do for your entire life. Gifts and share. All right, that's all I have. Thank you for listening. Bye.